2020 started with some great laptop announcements, and despite some shortages and delays, many of those are now available. These are our favorite laptops of 2020 so far. For this list, I, along with CNET's other laptop reviewers, Dan Ackerman and Laura Grunin, tested a bunch of laptops over the past few months and went through and selected a few of our favorites to put on your short list. Let's dig in. First on the list, but not in any particular order, is the Dell XPS 13. Well, we really like the whole 2020 XPS lineup, but the XPS 13 has been our go-to ultra portable Windows pick for a couple years now, and for 2020, Dell gave us more screen in a smaller body. It has a new 13.4 inch display, and really the thing is pretty much just a display and a keyboard, and a lot of power and battery life inside. Next up is our ultra portable mainstay, Apple's MacBook Air. The 2020 Air is a winner mostly because Apple switched to a new Magic Keyboard. The older butterfly keyboard design was a bit of a literal sticking point for buyers, and this new design is definitely an improvement. Apple also returned to a $999 starting price, which makes Apple's least expensive laptop slightly more affordable. Now I'm moving on from big names to a boutique PC with the main gear element. The 15-inch gaming laptop was born from a collaboration with Intel. It's a slim, stylish, four-pound slab that hits the right gaming notes for its size, like a 144Hz display, an optomechanical keyboard with per-key RGB lighting, and either an NVIDIA 1660 Ti or RTX 2070 Max-Q graphics card. There's no bloatware here either, and Main Gear has great support to back it all up. And here's another gaming laptop. Meet the Asus ROG Zephyrus Duo 15, a monster name for a monster laptop with a 15.6 inch main display and a secondary tilting 14 inch touchscreen, which comes in handier than you might think, especially if you don't have room for an external display on your desk. Inside, you'll find up to an Intel Core i9 processor and an NVIDIA RTX 2080 Super Max Q, so plenty of gaming performance, but you'll pay for it with a starting price of $3,000. Way down the other end of the laptop market is the Lenovo Duet Chromebook. The little detachable 10-inch 2-in-1 is $300 and includes its snappy magnetic keyboard cover. It's a great around-the-house or a work-anywhere device that delivers above its price. And while I'm talking about Lenovo, its yoga lineup this year has been very strong, including and especially the C940, its top-of-the-line premium model. It's one of my favorites, and it really shows how good the two-in-one category has gotten over the years. There were also a few laptops that showed up toward the tail end of June that we've started testing but aren't quite finished with yet, but look promising, like this Gigabyte Aorus 15G. It's a gaming laptop with a Pantone certified display and a mechanical keyboard with Omron Blue switches. And we're also getting laptops with the latest AMD Ryzen chips, like this 13-inch HP Envy X360 that looks pretty sweet for less than $800. And then there's this 14-inch Acer Swift 3 with a Ryzen 7 4700U that is just a straight-up good value at $650. So there you have it. That's our list of some of our favorite laptops of 2020 so far. Thanks for watching. And are there any that we missed? Let us know down in the comments and uh, check us out on CNET.com for all of our laptop and tech coverage.